vlog, welcome to the beginning of it. Um, yes, I am filming on my phone in the gym as I'm editing this vlog because I realized I didn't update you all on my Apple Watch. <laughs> I ended the vlog because that's honestly how my night ended. I went to bed not knowing if I was actually going to hear from this girl or not. I did, she messaged me back, she was so nice. She got rid of the activation lock and now I have a lovely new Apple Watch with the cutest bands, by the way. I'll have them linked down below. But yes, thank you everyone who was so worried and concerned about my Apple Watch. Thank you for good humans in the world. She was so sweet and thank you guys for being good humans. Enjoy the vlog. Good morning vlog. It's like a gloomy day in LA, but you wouldn't be able to know because I'm not in the basement right now. I'm so excited. I slept in the basement last night, but I've been working out of the corner to like test it in my new room upstairs. I had a therapy session today. I got some work done. I'm already loving it. Like having a window, I don't know if you can see it. Can you see? There's just like green out there. Like it makes me so freaking happy. But what I wanted to do was show you what I was doing downstairs. So let's go do that. So one of the things that Shelby left behind that she said she didn't care about anymore was this thing called a click and grow. Haley and I love plants. So we decided to keep it. Let me show you what it is. So the click and grow is this little thingy here. And you just like buy these little individual pods and then you can plant all these things and it will like use the right amount, the correct amount of like lighting. There's lights on this thing and all we have to do is just um, monitor the water levels. I just bought these two, polka dot plant and dill. We have mini tomatoes, peppermint, strawberry. I'm excited. So which Haley, what should we grow? Which one do we want to do? I like the tomatoes for sure. Maybe we do, I was thinking. And maybe mint. See, I was thinking, tell me what your thoughts are. Tomato, dill, polka dot plant. Because tomatoes and dill go good together. And That's I just really I mean. want the polka dot plant. But do the strawberries actually work? Like, yeah. how come it didn't work last time? Remember Rob the Straub? <laughs> um, I think because we let the water level get way too low at one point. Okay. Maybe. Let's try it out. So I'm gonna take it out and I think I just, I gotta Google this. Update, just checked. And there are like three little, oh God, like plastic cups that are supposed to go in here that um, I threw away in the move because there was like like pen written on it, like with individual like tomato, strawberry. And so I thought like, oh, these are the things you throw away. It wasn't. I threw away the thing that we needed to grow it. So now we can't grow anything. And so this was not a very exciting vlog segment, but on to the excitingness of the website emailing me when it becomes available. <laughs> well, that was a fail, but all of you home life hack humans out there, we just undid the dishes and undid. We just um, took out the dishes and some of the our dishes were, like weren't clean. So I've been like Googling like ways to clean your dishwasher. And apparently one of them is to put white vinegar in a cup on the top rack of your dishwasher and then run it through and that'll clean it. So I'm gonna do that right now. I also saw something on like the Today Show with Al Roker that was like, mm. you can also sprinkle baking soda on the bottom rack to give it like a little bit, I don't know, get that fresh smell. So that's what I'm gonna do. If you have any like hacks on the best ways to clean your dishwasher, kind of give it a refresh, comment down below. So because last night Lonnie and I moved um, some stuff upstairs to the new room so that I could like visualize a little bit better, here's the current state of my basement bedroom. <laughs> oh my God, it's so empty. Ignore the dirty wall where my feet have been. I'm sorry, it's been a long two years. Oh my God, it looks so, empty in here, so messy. Like, what? This is insane. I don't recognize it. Honestly, it's good though, because it made me want to move upstairs even more, like make this happen quicker. I gotta decide if I want to keep this, if I want to paint it, if I want to sell it, just get a brand new one. I'm gonna have to sell the nightstand, both of those. And I gotta, I gotta, I have so much to figure out, so much. But like, this is my bedroom. It's like the end of an era. I, yeah, I like carpet in the bedrooms. I'm not a fan of the hardwood in the bedrooms. Is that just me? I, apparently it's like an unpopular opinion. Haley, Shelby, my friend Janine, they all like hardwood in the bedroom. I like carpet. Comment down below, what do you think? Well, I was trying to get some work done, but then our Wi-Fi just shut off completely and I got a notification from Spectrum that there's an outage in our area. We love that. So now I'm just gonna go downstairs Sit on the couch, try and work on my phone, I guess. Sit close to the window, get some LTE, with no Wi-Fi. <sighs> Stressful, I mean, I really should just start moving stuff up to my room now, but like, 
there's just one brand deal that I really need to like look at and work on and potentially take pictures for today. So it's really what I wanted to get done, but it's already three o'clock. An hour later, it's four o'clock. Wi-Fi is still out. I still cannot get any of the work done that I plan on getting done today, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna go visit Shelby tonight. She is recovering. She just had double jaw surgery and she is in a world of pain and uncomfortableness right now. And I just, ugh, I feel, I feel for her so much. I just want to give her a big hug. Um, so the plan is as long as she's still feeling up for it and that Cooper's allowed, me, Haley and Cooper are going to go over there tonight and watch The Bachelorette with her and her mom and her dad. I'm just like, what can I bring you? What do you need? So I'm doing what, um, you know, any good Jewish girl does. I'm making her matzo ball soup. She actually loves matzo ball soup. She's always just like, wait, you're making matzo ball soup? So I'm making that for her and she has a Vitamix there. So I was thinking I would just bring it all to the Airbnb where she's staying and then they would just blend it up for her so that she can enjoy it. Um, I'm not gonna include noodles in it, but I do want her to get some, I don't know, like vegetables or something. I don't know, she was saying she's like, not very hungry because she's just not really moving. Like all the pain meds she's on just like makes her really sleepy. Um, so I'm just making it with matzo balls and carrots. So now let's make some matzo balls. All right, matzo balls are done. We've got 15 here. Time to scoop them in. Can I do this one-handed? Maybe I'll just do one of them because I really don't want to ruin it. Okay, okay. And in you go, just like Passover. <laughs> My mom would be proud. Grandma Shell would be very proud. Oh, get on there, get on there. Okay, the more I walk into my, my room like this, I'm really starting to get excited about this whole situation. I know I was really nervous, but I think it's gonna be good. This just, it feels right. Uh, Wi-Fi eventually did come back on, but now Haley and I and Cooper are gonna go visit Shelby, make sure she's doing okay before the sun goes down. Oh, I just like ran up the stairs. Hang out in her um, little backyard of the Airbnb. I think Cooper's really gonna put a big smile on her face. I think we are too. I'm also really interested to see what blended up matzo ball soup is going to be like, but I think it's gonna be good. It smells good. Great, I'm just, yeah, <sighs> I'm out of breath. It's weird that this is my room now. Oh my God, I just for some reason think that this soup in a Tupperware just looks so freaking strange. Please hold up well till we get there. Um, I also got Shelby a little paint by numbers just because I've been obsessed with paint by numbers and I feel like she's just gonna be doing a lot of sit sitting around and she likes that minimalist plant vibe. And then I got her a second one and I do not remember, I think it's like, um, overlooking some type of lake thing, but it's in a tube, so hey, hope she likes it. Oh hey, it's the next day and I forgot to tell you that um, Haley and Cooper and I went over to go visit Shelby at the Airbnb. She's staying out with her parents. It was so good to see her. I just wanna like hug her and squeeze her and make her feel better, but obviously I, I didn't. We all kept our distance, but it was just so good to see her and it made me really happy that she liked the matzo ball soup. I'm probably gonna be bringing more over later on this week, along with some ice cream. She's definitely championing, th championing, I can't even say it. She's definitely a champion. She is pulling through. She's gonna make it through all of this. Just, yeah, very proud of her for knowing what she needs to do. Had a little guitar session last night. Had to like commemorate the last night in my basement bedroom because I'm moving on up <laughs> today. I'm so excited. My friend Lonnie's coming over. We're gonna move it. We're gonna move as much as we can fit up there, mostly focusing on the bed and clothes. I think I'm gonna spray paint this black shelf white, put the dresser in the closet. Definitely have to sell my two nightstands. Um, I don't know what I wanna do with that thing. I have a lot to figure out, Spatial, spatially, spatially? Yeah, I have a lot to figure out and so I feel like I have to move it all up there, all of my like necessities and then I can figure out what I need to sell, what I could buy, office organization, so yeah, that's gonna be my day. I had this whole plan. I was like, oh, I'm gonna have a really intense workout today before my friend Lonnie comes over. No, no, that's that's not smart. I think I'm just gonna go um, edit a vlog on the desk bike in the garage gym and just burn some calories because um, did I have in and out last night with Haley? Yeah, yes I did. I gotta be real with you. I am so obsessed with these biker shorts. I think they're so freaking cute. I didn't, I wasn't sure if I liked the length of like the long ones, but 
I'm such a fan. I'm such a fan. Thank you, Amazon. Do, do, do. <laughs> okay, okay. We are back. Today's the day. I've got reinforcements. Lonnie's here. She's ready. She's been wanting to move this mattress Let's for like go! days now. I am so nervous about moving this up the stairs, but sh I have full confidence in you. <laughs> I have full confidence in us. Woo! All right, <laughs> one flight of stairs. What's the plan here, Lonnie? Okay. So we're gonna bring it back to here. Okay. And, but we do it at an angle, and so the tail end of it goes towards the door, and then we go up. Woo. <laughs> Wow, bed frame. We don't need no man. We don't need no man. You just need a lot of I don't even wanna tell you how we got this thing up here without disassembling it, but we did it. Thank you, Lonnie. Thank you, Haley. That was touch and go. Oh my God, it, it's, it's alive and it didn't break. <laughs> We did it, we did it, check it out. I think I'm going to like this, I think. I'm little worried that my head being so close to the door because of the way that sound travels and comes up the stairs, I'm foreseeing it as a potential issue, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it here until it's an issue. I'm happy with this right now. I think it actually looks a lot better than I was expecting it to, yay. All right, after all that, the dresser, um, well, it, it fits, but Lonnie, show them, uh, show them why this isn't gonna work out. Oh, uh, no. I mean, you can still get in there. Too. So, I think what I need to do is sell the dresser, get figure, we're gonna move the other clothes up here, but man, that's a bummer. <sighs> okay, well, we, we, we tried. <laughs> Starting to look good, though. Hey, this it's, just means that you have to get rid of things. And I gotta just, like, buy more things. Hey, so I realized I did not even like update you or close out anything on what happened today. Here's what we did. We did this. That doesn't fit. You know that already, but here's what we really did. Oh, look at that. Rose gold for most of the things. We're gonna ignore the black hangers, but like the rose gold purple hangers that I ordered more of honestly has like changed the outlook of my closet. I feel like it's like an out, like an adult closet. I still have a lot of things to go through, but I had to update you there. Oh, Lonnie is just an incredible human who really just helped me organize everything today. I just got back from a date. It went really well. He was very nice. And I feel like I went from like moving all of my things up the stairs to just like being like, oh my God, I gotta get ready and I gotta go on this date. The date went well. Um, Fun fact, a bird on my head. Uh-huh. So like right here, because my hair was straight when I left the house, and then right about here. Yeah, it was the whole thing. Four minutes in, I was putting my drink order in, and then I just got hit. <laughs> I guess it's good luck. It was all in good fun, and it was really very, very, very funny, and I had a great night. I really did. I just realized I never closed out the vlog, so I'm just gonna tell you to like this video and subscribe to my channel and my main channel or my vlog channel, wherever you're watching this. Just subscribe and watch all the things because I got pooped on today. Yep, okay, see the next one, bye. A few moments later. I don't know when you're gonna see this, but it is my first night sleeping up in my new room.
and I'm so excited and I don't even know if I like did this whole talking to the camera mirror thing, but I kind of like it. It's really big. I want to do this more. I want to make things cute. I want to put a plant there. I want to put plants everywhere. It's exciting. Another exciting thing is these Cozy Earth shorts just came in. Oh my God. A few Cozy Earth things came in. That's not like the reason why I turned this camera on, but I tried to tell you how soft these shorts are that I'm wearing. Um, yeah, we'll talk about that later. I just want to tell you how excited I am. I've had wine and now I'm just like, nostalgic's not the word. I've had wine and I'm just excited to have a little bit of sunlight. Just you. Okay, yeah. Um, my inner producer voice was like, time to shut the camera off. Yay, here's to night one, the new place. Ooh.